So I'm here at Trenton. Isla Mays restaurant. Let's go. The birds chirping today here in Trenton. They got a hotep. I might do that too. These are priced really well. The comeback sandwich is only $8.50. The Hotep sandwich is $9. Dang, they got Nubian wings too. I'm actually quite curious to know what a Nubian wing tastes like. We're gonna get the fish sandwich, some wings, and I'll let you know how it is, all right? Yeah, the area, this, they have a nice sit-in area here. No park, you can't park in the front. You gotta park on the side street, but that's permit parking only, so hopefully I don't get ticketed, but parking is, looks like it's not good. All right. But I didn't put the cheese, I didn't put the lettuce and tomatoes in the sauce on it. We have t-shirts with African print dresses. Skirt. I'm Isla. Been in business for 11 years. I came after my dad, a Mafico, who was on Stuyvesant for over 40 years. Experience and tradition of great taste at Isla Mays. Homemade sweet potato pies, bean pies, butternut squash pies, fresh fruit salads. Did you mention the dinners? No, I didn't mention the dinners. We have beef ribs, stew beef, pepper, pepper. steak, barbecue chicken, baked chicken, fried chicken, smothered chicken. Real chicken. Real chicken. We have whiting, flounder, flounder. balsa, salmon, and salmon could be fried or uh, grill. We have cabbage, collard, string beans, corn, mac, yams, rice, mashed potatoes, potato salad, mac macaroni salad with tuna, and all dinners come with rice and gravy and a corn muffin. How'd you get started, sir? I got started about 42 years ago at, um, it, it used to call, it was called the storefront pit. And I was in a gentleman's office and he says, I'm tired of this restaurant. So I said to him, let me lease it. He said, okay. So I was in there for a year. He says, listen, I want to sell it. So I went to the bank to get a loan, fill out the application, and the loan officer told me that you were not approved because you didn't have enough equity. So I went home and I meditated on that. And I said, there's enough equity in the property. So I went back and I spoke to the loan officer. And I said, I would like to speak to your boss. So I sat down with her and I told her that there was enough equity in the property because I was only asking for $20,000. And so she said, well, let me reconsider. She did, she called me the next day and said, come pick up the check. And the rest is history. It's in the present, it's still the present, it's still going on. And the Mayfickers was for a unique experience and fast food. So when you see Isla Mays, you see a Mayfica. Here we go. Let's do the uh, grilled chicken uh, cheesesteak. This has lettuce, tomatoes, turkey bacon, grilled chicken. Rolls very nice and warm. Very pillowy. Try this out. This is the Tiffany. Mm. That turkey bacon in there, popping. Mmm. That's good. Good grilled chicken. I like the bread. The bread is very soft. Good flavors. I think that's like mayo. The turkey bacon is what gives it like that nice savory pop to the sandwich. Very good. Very good. So all these sandwiches are very affordable. I think I've seen anything from like eight dollars, nine, ten bucks. It's a good. Uh, it's just like a good quick lunch type of sandwich. Like it's gonna be fulfilling, but the size is not gonna put you down. Very good. Mmm. That's a Tiffany. That's very good. Very good. Good bread selection. All amazing. It's very uh, Afrocentric, so all this is a high vibrational food, okay? 
This is the sandwich that started it off, our fish sandwiches here. This is called the comeback. You eat this, you're gonna come back. Let's do the inspection. Good size, nice uh, fillet. Hey, how are you? Good, good, good. My hands are, please man, how are you? Good, good, how's your chest game? I haven't been practicing. All right, well mine sharp and mine, yes, come in with a fair game one day. Absolutely. I met, I met the father who's uh, started this all, and then now it's passed down to Isla Mays. And the sandwiches, oh, what we got here? Oh, thank you, thank you. Yeah, that's Tiffany's. It's good, it's good. I love the bread selection, is that like honey wheat? Yes. Very good, very good. Okay. All sandwiches come on now. Look at this. Those are sweet and spicy wings. Sweet and spicy wings. No, no. Oh, it looks sticky, but I got, And that's oh. just a sample, so you can sample. So I appreciate the sample. We got some mac and cheese, some yams and greens. Yes. Looks amazing. Thanks. Thank you. All oh, right. can I, can I, do you have like an iced tea or anything like that? No, yeah. I'm gonna give you a Kool-Aid. 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 Hot sauce, mandatory. They got cheese on here, but you can opt not to get cheese. I know some of y'all are real funny when it comes to seafood and cheese. Me, I don't mind it. I like the creaminess of it. Cheers. Oh, hell yeah. Wow, that was crunchy. That was super crunchy. The flavors on the, on the fish. Is never the same Kool Aid? That looks great, thank you. Alright. Scream if you need us. Yes, ma'am, thank you. Wow. Their fish sandwich has the right amount of crunch. Fried flavors. Good coolness from the lettuce and tomatoes. Good cheese. Again. There's such a, a light but packing with flavor sandwich here. The comeback. I'm coming back for this. I am coming back for this. That was delicious. Should we take a break and go for the wings? Or should we do this? Let's do this. Let's knock out all the sandwiches. This is the emery. It's got the, this has the broccoli in here. This is the salmon that's chopped up. Mm. All the sandwiches come in a honey wheat roll. This has chopped up uh, salmon. It has shrimp in here. We call this a fish hoagie back in Philly. That's a fish hoagie right there. Y'all don't know how much I needed this. My fish content, I enjoy a lot. Just because I know it's not going to weigh me down later. Oh, good touch. The bread. The bread is always, it's a good finish. Like it's that nice sweetness to it. There's a nice sweetness to this bread. Mm. That's enjoyable too. That is very enjoyable. Very enjoyable. Um, but that fish sandwich, the comeback, there's something about just fried fish that's done right with that soft honey wheat bread and some cheese and some hot sauce. That's high vibrational right there. You know what I mean? This is about as small business as it gets. Owners here, 
Um, it looks like grandmom's cooking. You know what I mean? Auntie cooking back there. Yeah, this is home cooked type of sandwiches and home cooked meals. Sugar syrup is pretty good. You don't need to shake this. Very satisfied, very satisfied. Let's do the wings. Man, that fish sandwich, that fish sandwich is good. Get the fish sandwich. Get the fish sandwich. Because I'm gonna eat. She gave me a sample, I didn't order this. She was like, well, since you're here, you gotta try our sides. These are very popular too. And it looks amazing. Can y'all see? Can y'all see the sides? The mac and cheese, the yams, the greens, the wings. Look at that. Super sticky sauce. I'm gonna be licking my fingers after this. Game changers. These are popping. The, the sauce is popping on this. Paired up with the sides. Those greens are phenomenal. They're like party wings. These wings are phenomenal. Great crunch. It's not super crunchy like a banchan, but there's a nice satisfying crunch when you bite into this, when your teeth sinks in. So like, if you have sensitive teeth, this is not gonna break your teeth. There's a nice satisfying crunch to it, but that sauce. The sides are, the sides are playing its part. You know what I mean? Michael Jackson, the Jackson 5, playing a part. You know what I'm saying? Tito, Michael. These greens today are phenomenal. <laughs> but these wings, to me, I came here for the fish hoagie. And y'all know, the fish hoagie, the fish itself. That was addicting. That, those sandwiches are good lunchtime meals. But when it comes to dinner time and entree time, y'all, y'all, these wings, and I'm a wing fanatic. I am a wing fanatic. These are top tier wings. I'm gonna say it just like that. Well, what makes this more enjoyable is a slice of bread. Or maybe two slices of bread. I can eat with this and then that, but these are crazy. I know everybody got the the wing spot, you know, that they swear up and down by. Give this place a try and let me know what you think.
This is a, you know, treat yourself type of meal. You get these wings on some sides. Some of the best wings I've had in a long time. I mean, I've been eating wings for a while. And I have my spots that I go to just, just to get my wing fix. These wings. I'm gonna stop talking, I'm gonna stop talking. I'm gonna stop talking. Let me tell you something, those wings are like party wings. You go to somebody's party, graduation party, those are the wings they just serve in here, bro. Real deal. You just witnessed some big back activities. You know, you, you know when you get done this part, there's still like that cartilage on top, big back activities. Like I said, when it comes to fish sandwich, I kind of like mine's, I like the comeback. These wings were knocked it out the park, out of this world. 10 out of 10. So everything came out to 44.53, the take card, I left them a $20 tip. And that's how we rolling, baby. You know what I mean? See you on the next one. We have t-shirts with African prints. We have scarves. We have um, leggings. We have more t-shirts. We have three-piece suits for men. And that's with the crown, the top, and the pants. We have dresses, African dresses, skirts, black soap, shea butter. We have um, turmeric soap. We have hair products. We have incense. We have toothpaste without fluoride. We've been deceived to think that we need fluoride. We do not. Um, School them on that. That's crazy. Yes, for real. Uh, uh, Afrocentric historical books. Um, Destruction of Black Civil Civilization by Charles, uh, I mean Chancellor Williams. We have uh, Now Valley Contribution to Civilization by Anthony Browder. To a book by um, Ronoko Washi. He went throughout the world and pick, showed in different countries the, the presence of African presence. Uh, excellent book. Um, I gotta give a shout out to uh, our elder, uh, Dr. Joseph Ben Yakinen. Um, his book was We the Black Jews, Mother um, of Western Civilization, to name a few of his books. Now, this whole time, what or? happened was I opened this up for my son okay. to have a summer job. And he did it for two years and he says, you know what? I want to go to work for somebody else. Really? You want someone else to be your boss? Well, there's a lesson for you to learn. So he did. So it's still here and it's doing well. See you on the next episode. Peace.